Entertainment world is in mourn, as it lost the Oscar winning and Broadway composer and lyricist Stephen Sondheim. On Friday, the music theater giant passed away at the age of 91, leaving an endless number of works that keeps him alive in the music and theater world forever. Sondheim was born in 1930 in New York City, and soon he became an important figure in the 20th century musical theater. Pleasure because, as most of you know, the, the show that Lee was referring to, her baptism in musical theater was Anyone Can Whistle, and I'm responsible partly for that running only six performances. He was credited for reinventing the American musical, as his shows tackled unexpected themes that were fairly creative compared to the genre's traditional subjects. His music and lyrics were unprecedented in complexity and extraordinary in sophistication. An acclaimed lyricist and composer, Stephen Sondheim is a master of the American musical. His witty, poignant shows tell tales of misfits, romantics, dreamers, and lunatics. The range of work including a funny thing happened on the way to the Forum, Company, Follies, and Sunday in the Park with George, sparked in the theater musical world to give chance to the audience to live the joy that he left in his music. Sondheim won many awards that include eight Tony Awards, nine Grammys, an Oscar, and a list of well-needed awards for the history he made. So what I learned from him was, you know, how to tell a story and so on, which is not what Cole Porter was doing or Roger and Hart. There are other ways to write songs and other uses of them. Sondheim's death was announced by his lawyer and friend, F. Richard Pappas, who described his death as sudden, and the day before, he had Thanksgiving dinner with his friends. Right. 